Hey everyone, it's Jessica and welcome to another thrifting trip. My first stop on today's trip is Goodwill and I also stopped at another thrift store for the second half of today's video. I did find some really cool items from both stores today. I found something for myself, I found something for my home, and I also found a couple of items that will be gifted. And I will share everything that I found from both stores at the end of today's video. So keep watching to find out what I scored today. And as always, let me know what your favorite item was on today's trip. I always enjoy reading everybody's answers down in the comments. So this was my first time ever seeing any donated Baby Yoda items at Goodwill. I thought this nightlight was adorable. I really couldn't think of anybody who I could gift it to, so I decided to go ahead and leave it behind for someone else. So I spotted these white marble bookends and they're exactly my style. So when I was checking them out, I noticed there were a few little chips on the back of one of them and on the corner. And normally I don't buy chipped items, but I think they can be hidden pretty easily if I just turn them backwards. I'm curious to know, does anyone have a face steamer like this one here? And if you do, do you like it? And the last thing that I wanted to share with you guys before I take you into the second thrift store was this adorable little pineapple mirror. I didn't need it, but I thought I would share it with you guys. I thought it was too cute. So the first thing that caught my eye at this particular thrift store was this small Coca-Cola basket. I'm not really a Coke collector, but I thought it was cute and it was priced really well at $3.99. In case you happen to be new here to my channel and you also enjoy thrifting and thrift hauls, definitely check out my playlist that I will link here at the top of the screen. It's all of the thrifting videos that I have done so far this year in 2021. I always add to it every week with a new video, so definitely check out that playlist if you want to see everything that I've scored throughout the year.
This wooden cactus box right here was really nice and the price is a little hard to read but it was $2.49. So I happened to spot this lamp right here and I thought it was pretty interesting and I'm wishing I would have took the time to plug it in when I was at the store just to see how it looked lit up. And the last thing that I wanted to share with you guys before I show you my haul today is this random box of mini collector spoons. I had so much fun looking through this collection and let me know down below if you have any of these collector spoons, I would like to know. So I did find a spoon that I really loved down in that box. It was $1.99 and it had roses on the end of it. I thought it would make the perfect tea or coffee spoon. I have been wanting a pretty one to use for a while now, so this one works out perfect. And speaking of coffee, I also purchased that random coffee mug for 49 cents. It was made in England and I got it to go inside of this basket here that I also purchased at that last thrift store. The basket was $2.99 and I'm planning on making a small gift basket out of it. I'm obviously not done with the gift basket. I'm going to add some chocolates down inside of the mug and I'm also going to add a Starbucks gift card. As you can see, I have some freshly shelled pecans in the Ziploc bag, and I will also add a big bow to the handles and it will be good to go as a gift. The next item that I purchased today was from Goodwill. So this purse happened to catch my eye because of its odd, unique shape, and I really loved the color. I had been looking for a new small purse, and this one was perfect. It was only $2.19, and it was from the Victoria Leather Company in the USA. It was in excellent condition. It had no dirt, scratches, or tears on it at all, so I was super happy to score this. And I just have one of those small Small removable purse organizers down inside of the middle that way I can keep it clean it also has a big pocket on the front and my phone fits in here perfectly and it's easy to access and it also has two small pockets on each side it also has a long adjustable strap it's the perfect little crossbody purse and I just love it and the last item that I purchased from Goodwill today was that pair of white marble bookends. The price was $1.99 for the pair. Right now I just have them on my kitchen counter. They are holding up some of my favorite vegetarian and vegan cookbooks. These books were also previous thrift finds as well as the fruit bowl that is beside it. I may eventually move these somewhere else, but for right now, I think they look really good here in this corner. So that is everything that I found from both thrift stores today, except for my dog Peanut right there. She loves checking out my thrift finds when I bring them home. Once again, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope this video inspires you to go thrifting. You never know what you're going to find. Thanks again, and I will see you guys in the next video.